Hey, what's going on guys? How's everyone doing today? I'm doing well. Thank you for asking. Again, look where we're at guys. We're in the everyday kitchen. Whoop! Thank you, Jackie Chan, for teaching me all you know. Akuna Matata. Thank you. Guys, how's everyone doing? Man, I hope you're doing so dadgum well. Uh, what are we going to do today, guys, in the everyday kitchen? Well, let me show you a little bit what we're going to do. Come on! Over here! We got a little bit of green onions. Huh? We got a little bit of chicken tenderloins, a little bit of minced garlic, a little bit of cream of mushroom, a little bit of roasted garlic alfredo sauce, and some nasty cochicada yadi hi hi. Yeah, whatever those are called. So today we're gonna do a little bit of a uh, quick dinner. Uh, it's something I just kind of found, pulled together, if you will. This is actually two different kinds of noodles. Oh, I had another little bit in another box, so I just dumped it in here. And Well, we're going to make the best of it. Don't matter what you use, as long as you use something. So, let's throw the dadgum chicken in the skillet. Come on! Let's use a little bit of extra virgin olive oil. Throw a little bit of chicken off in here. So we got the chicken started guys. And I will eventually, once everything gets going, I'm going to put a few little herbs and spices in there make it all good. We'll cut up some long stem green onions or scallions or whatever you want to call them. I think they go by a couple of names. I hope they're still good. They've been in the fridge for a while. They feel good. I feel like they'll be alright. This is just going to be enough for really me and then maybe one little small help. And if my wife wants some when she gets home, I'm not making a whole bunch. So, yeah, I'll cook up a little bit of this right here and see how it goes. So, we'll check in in a bit. Hang around. Now, you notice I just put some minced garlic in the skillet. Now, there's no rhyme nor reason as to when I put the minced garlic in my skillet, in my food and stuff. Sometimes I forget to the very end. Sometimes I do it at the beginning. It just depends on what the old brain remembers, guys. What it's thinking, you know? So, and yes, as far as Alfredo sauce goes, you can make your own. Uh... It's not real difficult, and you can find recipes all on online and on YouTube and all that. But, for the most part, we usually just buy the old jars of uh, pre-made stuff. So, yeah, one of these days I'll make my own. And, uh, I don't always put this in there, but I figured, uh, give it a little bit more taste, a little bit more zing, a little bit more zest, a little bit more something, a little bit of that Kung Pao, yeah! off in there you know so we'll go ahead and do that we still got the chicken going over there with the minced garlic all bubbly boiling together they're gonna make a wonderful combination and uh really everything kind of goes pretty quick i'll put these in a little bit later uh once the chicken's pretty much done and kind of let these cook in just a smidgen bit and then we'll kind of add the other stuff and kind of go from there so we'll check back in a minute
Now you'll notice I didn't use the whole can of the cream of mushroom. Just didn't want to put uh, too much sauce in there because really I don't even think it's going to be a big enough serving for my wife and me. Probably it's going to be a small serving so I'm just, I don't want to overdo it, overpower it. So yeah, I got my water going. Uh, just a little bit of water since we only have a little bit of noodles. I think this is going to be good guys, so I'm going to let the water get to boiling up and I'm going to throw my noodles in there and it will be like seconds away. Alright guys, got a nice little meal here, as you can tell I didn't overdo it, now I do have stuff for a salad in there so I might end up making a salad later, I don't know, just depends on how I feel, uh, but you've seen how quick and easy this was, and I'm surprised that I didn't already have this uh, in an episode of my everyday kitchen, I make this, you know, we make this pretty often, so I'm really surprised that this was not already in the playlist. If you can find it in there, then let me know. So, and as you can tell, I just got some toast and I put a little bit of butter on there. And uh, and you've seen how easy it was. It's quick, simple, easy. No big deal, guys. I'm um, kind of looking. I don't know if I want to put some garlic salt on there or not. Probably not. I'm probably good with what I got. So anyways, guys, I'm going to go sit down at my desk and enjoy my dinner i hope you enjoyed this new episode of the everyday kitchen and i hope you check out all my videos like share subscribe comment all that good stuff check out the playlist that's where 99.99999999 percent of everything is you might some you might find some random videos in the random video section but most things are in the playlist also check out my other channel old mental pickle that's where i live stream video games only matter of fact i might be live streaming today well depending on whenever this video gets out it's saturday right now so it just depends be on the lookout like share subscribe comment all that good stuff push my channels out there i'm a good wholesome wonderful guy maybe maybe i'm not maybe all right guys We'll see you next time on Mikey Sin TV and hopefully one day soon another episode of The Everyday Kitchen. We'll see y'all later. I'm going to go eat. Get up, get out, get ready, do it, do it!